What are those situations in your life that are making you always flow in your own tears? What is that condition that you think there may be no remedy for it again? Do you know that things are not meant to be permanent? Those things that have been in your life that are not planted by the Lord are not meant to be permanent. That is the reason there is a big and greater change coming your way now. There is a mighty turn of events in your life. God has said it and that is what he will do for you, no matter the situation. Because there is no mountain that the Lord cannot move. There is no valley that the Lord cannot fill up. There is no ocean that is too wide and deep that God cannot cross through or lead you through. What you just have to know is that God is the almighty God and there is nothing impossible for him to do. Are you in a very great financial debt? Your properties are on the verge of being confiscated by the people you are owing money. Is it a critical health situation that you have tried all you can? You have prayed and been prayed for. You have tried all medical therapy that could do the job, but in your situation, the therapy is not productive. God is watching you and he is working out a better change for you. It may seem like God is not saying anything or God is not doing anything. But the truth remains that there is nothing that happens on earth that happens outside the knowledge of the Almighty. What are your fears? What are your troubles? Are you about to give up on yourself? Are you about to let go and end your dreams halfway because of the difficulties and tough times that you are going through? That is not the solution. That is not the remedy. The only way you can get going and keep getting results is by keeping your fighting spirit high and letting your hope consistently remain on and looking unto Jesus, the author and the one that will perfect your faith. There is a change that is coming your way. There is a season that you are about to enter and this season is a season of your breakthrough. It is a season that will bring you all the things that you have lost in the course of waiting and hoping that it all will be well. If you want change, you do not just start in a place you expect it to come. If you want God to change your situations, if you want God to take away your reproach, if you want God to heal you of all your diseases and give you the perfect restoration that you have been praying for, you do not have to relent and fold your hands. There was a woman that suffered with the disease of the blood for many years. She had spent all that she had trying to get herself out of that situation, but it was not really working. She had waited for healing, but no result was coming her way. For many years, seasons after season, years after years, this woman had tried all that is in her power and capacity, even beyond her own power. But it is not yielding any positive result for her. But she is not relenting in her pursuit to be healed and made whole. She believed that her change is going to come. She did not give up. She did not let go of her faith. All she did was to keep her hopes high and make sure her expectations were not cut short at all. Life is not ideal, but you have to make your life and your world suitably ideal. That was the philosophy that this woman lived on. One day, her change came and God helped her out of that situation. Our Lord Jesus was passing that way and she was hearing the noise of the crowds walking and the different voices took. So, to God she asked, what is happening? She was very sensitive that she knew when her change came around. She knew when God had come around 
to give her the desires of her heart. And that was the way she got herself to go touch the garment of Jesus. As she said in her heart, I will touch his garment and when I touch it, I will get my healing. And that was what she did. Immediately, she got her healing. Luke 8 verse 47 That is what God is about to do for you. That is what God has in thought to do for you. A great change is coming your way. A great turnaround is coming your way. Your prayers for many years have been given attention. The desires of your heart are about to be granted and God is taking away that reproach away from your life. God is taking away the pain of many years from your life. God is bringing in the best season for you. You will begin to see how things will change for you because God has come into the situation. God has taken control. Your years of tears and pain are going away. You are no more in the place you used to be before. You are now going to the place God wants to take you to. Open your heart and see it happening already. Activate a faith that will bring it to your life. When you pray, when you ask anything from the Lord, there is nothing that will make your prayer potent if you do not pray in faith. Faith is the force that draws God into action when you pray. The words of the Lord said, without faith, no one can do anything to please God. If anyone wants to come to God, but first believe that God is, that is the faith you have in you. And when you know that God will do what he has said he will do for you, your question will be, how will you get the change to yourself? Know that God is able to do it for you. Believe that God will change your situation and everything will become perfect again. You may have lost the confidence that you had in God because you waited for the change and nothing is happening. There is no evidence of what you are expecting from the Lord. Trust God to always be that which you want to be. Trust God that the change will come your way. If you do not believe in God, what then will you believe? The words and the promises of the devil. You know wherever the devil comes into, he does not give life. Rather, he takes away life, kills people's joy and gives them painful sorrows, stealing their happiness and makes them a life of misery and unforgettable scars of sorrow on them. That is what the devil does. The devil will take away the pain you have in you and give you another pain in another area of your life. But God takes away the works of the devil in you and makes you free and free forever. That is the reason it is written that whoever the Son of Man sets free, the person becomes free forever. God is setting you free from the pain. God is changing that situation now and making you a better life and an inspiration to the world. People will begin to come to you for words and courage because of what the Lord has done in your life. God is interested in you. God has not forgotten you at all. God has given you the chance to live a better life and that change is coming to you already. Something very great and very massive beyond your thought and imagination is coming your way. It will shut down the mouths of mockers and the sharp tongues of critics. The changes that will happen in your life will make everybody that has not believed in you, those that have given up on you, those that have said you are not going to amount to anything in life, those that have said you have no value and are investing, you will not be profitable. Those that have campaigned that nobody shows interest in you, that they are all wrong. It will show them that God is not done with you yet. They will know by the massive change that God is still in the business of changing lives. 
That is what God is planning for you. You will see it and you will be merry that you have trusted and had faith that is paying you now with the rewards of blessings. Not just a blessing, but abundant blessings that will last longer for lifetime and your children will inherit from the goodness of God in it. God is opening a door for you, a door that has been shut for a long time and nobody cared for you. But now that God has opened the doors for you, prosperity is activated already in you.